Hello everybody, welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews. And today, got another episode of Search for Snacks. Searching for snacks, I came across these in my grocery store. And they had a couple different flavors. And I don't think I've tried these before, but these look kind of interesting, so I thought I'd give them a try. And they had several different flavors, and these ones appeared to be the most interesting to me. Because I know they have a lot of hot hot ones out there and nacho cheese and all that and these i found and i think they were like 250 for the bag it's by mission and this is salsa verde tortilla chips they also had i think it was a nacho and a hot one and a uh, chipotle i think was the other flavor i don't remember exactly but um that's what they were i thought it would be interesting to try them then, and for seven, I can't even say it, seven servings per container, about nine chips, which is not very many. It's 140 calories and 200 milligrams of sodium. If you want to see the ingredients list, there you go. And it's gluten-free. Trend, zero trans fat per serving. So there we go. And this is going to be you know, like a tomatillo and a tomatillo and jalapeno kind of flavor. Maybe a little spicy, I don't know. And what does it say on here? For years, Salsa Verde has been a staple of every Mexican kitchen for its zesty, spicy flavor. Mission brings you the true authentic flavor in your new favorite snack with Salsa Verde flavored tortilla chips. Try these delicious chips as a snack or with your favorite meal. Por muchos años, and then I guess it's all in here. Yeah, it's all in Spanish, muchos años, and all that. Basically what I just read, it's in Spanish, so I guess they want to give equal opportunity to everybody. And yeah, the ingredients are listed in both English and in Spanish. So, I'm going to open this up without making too much noise. And there we go. And wow. Oh, wow. I could smell that the green flavor right away. And yeah, this one's pretty good. So, most of them are intact. You can see in there. And yeah, again, these are filled up pretty high, but. It's about halfway, most of it's air, like most of the bags, they settle down. And here's what the chip looks like, nice and round, fairly thick. I can smell that salsa flavor on it. It's actually pretty good. Nice uh, multi-grain chip here, tortilla. And here we go, I'm gonna give it a try. Mmm, nice and crispy. It is a little thick for tortilla chip. It reminds me of the Doritos, except these are round. And I think Doritos does have a salsa verde version of their, one of their chips. I think I've seen to have tried it before. Hmm, nice and crunchy. It's got good spice to it. Not overly, not overly spicy. Pretty good, as you can see. Hmm. Just a little heat, not a whole lot. Tasted more of that tomatillo flavor, like that kind of nice green salsa type flavor it does yeah it does have a little bit of heat I'm getting a little bit at the back of my throat mm-hmm just a little bit it's certainly not real hot like a ghost pepper or a habanero but yeah it does have a little bit of spice a little bit of burn kind of hits you in the back at the end 
but it's not half as hot as some of the the other ones, the habaneros, the ghost peppers, the flaming hot. No, this it kind of wears off quickly. It's actually got good flavor to it. I like the salsa verde version. I like the green sauce. I make a chili, green chili verde. I actually did a recipe for it. So I kind of like that. It goes real good with like, um, it goes good with uh, ground, uh, ground turkey or, you know, pork or whatever. These are actually pretty good. So maybe if you had it with a burrito or, a, well, I don't know, pork chops or <laughs> something like that, or, you know, a chicken thing or carnitas or something like that, you could maybe even use these as nacho chips on some, you know, not a taco salad. You can put, you know, chili or you can put carnitas or you can put, you know, any kind of thing you want, I guess, nacho cheese on it. If you really wanted to, this would be a little good alternative for it. But yeah, pretty good. A little bit of heat. Good flavor, nice and crisp, pretty good. So for my rating on the Salsa Verde Mission Chip, Tortilla Chip, give those, give those an eight out of 11. They're pretty good. I mean, I mean not, not spectacular. They're not like super hot like the other ones, but they are, they do have good flavor. These would be good for a snack, especially for people that don't like really, really hot stuff. I think you could handle this one. It's just got a little bit of spice and it goes away quick. So I found these at my supermarket. I think you could probably find them at your supermarket or maybe even Target or Walmart. I think they carry them. So if you want to give them a try, go ahead and get yourself a bag. And check them out so that's my rating on this one so if you like the video go ahead give it a thumbs up don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell right over there that way you won't miss any future content and you'll be notified of when i go live so until next time on drew's food reviews i'll talk to you guys later and i'm gonna go ahead and put these away because i can eat just one and put them away until next time so until next time, talk to you later. Cut. Take two. For those that want the true authentic language and play, there we go. <sighs> okay. Looper time. I dropped the bag. I have one, but... Okay.